who feels pushed aside by today's vote. By voting for the continuing resolution, Democrats agreed to delay a debate on immigration. Republican leader Mitch McConnell saying he intends to bring up the issue by February 8th. I spoke with a local dreamer lobbying in Washington for a permanent solution for undocumented immigrants. Right now we're, we're headed over to the Capitol. Fernanda Herrera Vera is one of 700,000 young adults currently under DACA protection, but she lives in fear every day. For mixed status families like my own, my, my mother and my father are both undocumented. I have DACA and my brother's a U.S. citizen. So, you know, every day we just kind of wake up with that fear. Hey, are my mom and dad going to get pulled over and get deported? Vera says immigrants like her feel pushed to the side. I've been here since I was two and a half. Um, and it's, it's not fair that I, that I have to live with the decisions that other people make. And I can't make those decisions on my own without voting. Vera is hoping and pressing for lawmakers to offer a permanent path to citizenship. And she's planning for her future in the U.S. Would ideally want to go to law school. I just, I want to contribute to this society as much as I can. And it's, it's difficult to do so with, without legal presence. Vera says she will continue fighting for what she calls basic human rights, as Congress will likely debate what to do about immigration by February 8th.